Logo, you know the vibes, man. Logo in the building. Logo, logo from the 773. You already know what time it is with me, gang. Logo, logo from the 773. <laughs> yeah, you already know It's so real because when niggas started seeing these YouTubers come to the town, bro, niggas were saying that they didn't even want to do this half of the shit I'm doing now. <laughs> niggas didn't even want to pull up to the parks, to the takeovers. Niggas wasn't traveling with me to Brooklyn, to Queens, to all these places where these the YouTubers is that. coming. Now, 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 <clears throat> everybody wants to do YouTube. Everybody wants to record. Everybody wants to do content. That's the fact. And I, now, no, no, wait, RJ, wait, wait, RJ. Now, now everybody wants to record. Let's really talk about it now, though. Because wasn't y'all just niggas that just was playing in them tournaments? Like Gersh? Like, like, like Rucker? Like Dykeman? Aren't y'all Hoopers? So the Hoopers should be staying over there with the Hoopers. Am I correct? Mm. The yeah, Hoopers should be boy. staying over there with yeah, the Hoopers. Yeah, because yeah, and because yeah, why y'all yeah, worrying about the people who's doing content if we're not so-called Hoopers? Yo. Who, but who's making that, 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 Hoopers, like who's making that whole content? Right? Yo, logo, logo. I don't give a fuck about what you talking about, bro. I don't care about Chris White. I don't care about nothing he's talking about, bro. Niggas got lives, bro. Niggas is grown men. I'm not a child. It's no children on this live right now. Stop bringing that child shit here, bro. Go over there, go back to his live, and go tell that nigga what I said now. Leave that children shit out of my live, bro. Get the fuck off our live you bringing that children shit here, bro. I'm a grown ass man. Yeah, fat boy. Time these niggas keep coming on this live talking about what Chris White said. Like if he like if he a father of somebody, like like if he run niggas. I don't give a fuck what he talking about. That nigga never came back to Brooklyn. Facts. Why sure. is that? Now back to what I was talking about. What I'm trying to say is that, right? Bro, I know so many people that create content who actually are hoopers who who done gain so much talent over the towns from playing against hoopers d frigger played d3 bro right. he went to a division three school bro to play in college you telling me this man is not a hooper yo can I, I real quick content? from from a nigga that playing tournaments bro me i'm just Feel me? I ain't nobody to be speaking for nobody, but I do play in tournaments. Feel me? When I went to go play against Frieda, bro, I ain't even know what the fuck I was going to play in. Honestly, I just went to go hoop. That's what it really... I went to go hoop. But when I seen afterwards, feel me, the, the like, just the, 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 the route that it was going, bro, I'm like, I would be dumb to not even indulge in this. Like, honestly, bro. Because at the end of the day, bro, niggas is playing ball in these tournaments, bro. What the fuck is, like, for me, like, honestly, bro, I'm not trying to be playing ball in New York for 20 years, bro. Feel me? So at the end of the day, bro, I seen, if, if I'm in a video and this shit getting a million views and I'm doing my thing in a video, bro, why would I not try to do that? Like, why would I not try to, like, promote myself, bro? That don't make sense, bro. Hey, hey, hey RJ, fat boy, why don't we let Matt... Explain because he started before all you guys did. Yeah, for sure. So go ahead, man. Yeah, the, the biggest shit of this is all like, all right. So like, I was outside doing this YouTube shit um, prior. Me and Vontae linked up. The thing about it is, is outside of the city, niggas don't think New York who, right? So my mindset with it was like, take the camera and kind of travel with it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. What you said? Niggas don't think New York outside. niggas be hooping. Niggas don't think that outside of the city, no. So what they what what they think people in New York do? They think that shit died. They think that shit died the, with Kemba. The, the mecca, the Sosa. mecca of basketball. Yes, I'm telling, I'm telling you, niggas think that shit died with Kemba, with Edgar Sosa. They think that shit died with niggas. It, when, when it get to the point that I be having arguments with niggas, and they talk about like our high school is coming up. Now, now obviously, like that's a whole different ball game. But the whole thing about it is, is that it's really a lot of money out here to be made, and it's a lot of stories that niggas got. A lot of niggas got different testimonies. A lot of niggas been through a lot of shit. Facts. And, and, and we're not doing it. 
Like, we got Chicago, we got Texas, we got Florida, we got Cali. We got everybody out there. They're not having these arguments. When it comes to the city, like, we having arguments amongst each other, and niggas is, like, kind of, like, laughing at us. Like, them Cali niggas, them niggas over there is, like, they, they, they doing shit together. They building shit together. Them, them, them Houston, Austin, Dallas niggas, them niggas is building together. Florida, they all doing that shit. That's why they all have teams. The difference is in the city, there's always some type of competition shit. Like, yep. like yep. RJ or, or, or like or like Fatboy, I'm over here. I'm sneak dissing niggas. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, uh -huh. Fatboy, he's decent, but he's not that good. You know, or or RJ solid, but he didn't play good in this game. Rather than niggas just building together. Like, if we the Mecca of basketball, that's something that we got to claim and we got to get back. Niggas don't think we doing that now. So when I, when I first came out with the camera shit and all that, I didn't know what I was doing. I just knew I had a testimony that I wanted to tell niggas. Like, you know what? My story is the same. Niggas probably came from a single parent household. Niggas probably ain't have money. Niggas, ain't, niggas was eating cups and noodles of soup for Thanksgiving. Like, it's certain shit that I have that I want to tell niggas, you know? I might not be the, the, the best nigga walking, but I know nobody works harder than me. So that's my story. That's my slogan. That's what I'm sticking with. And when I came to the city and I'm talking to niggas, every nigga that I've ever spoke to that plays basketball, I told them to pick up a camera and record because it's going to do something for somebody. It don't matter if, if it's a million people following you or a few kids. Thanks. But, but the thing about it is, is that everybody started getting caught up in this whole shit like, oh, yeah, well, you not valid. Or, yeah, you know, you worried about being a content creator. You worried about be something. Who gives a fuck if you Facts. got Man. a camera? Like, who cares? Like, we That's argue about something that doesn't matter. Niggas outside of the city don't care about that. Like, think about it. Everybody has an advantage over us that's outside of the city. Niggas got 12 months of hot weather. Niggas is always playing. They don't have to worry about access to the gyms. They don't have to worry about none of that shit. None of that. We over here, we got cold weather. We can't get access to gyms. We got fucking COVID regulations. We got all this bullshit going on. And that's what we're talking about. If we came together, niggas would not be having this conversation. If HGN, he got next, if, if, if a group of niggas went out to Cali and went to go play against Cali niggas, they're going to look at it as New York versus Cali. Facts. New York niggas is going to be like, well, that's not the real New York niggas. That's not the Facts. sanctioned niggas. That's not the talented niggas. Nobody's doing it. Nobody's doing it until somebody else does it. Now that everybody's picking up a camera, it's just niggas just got to come together and just make it work. Like, fuck all this competition shit. And, and the whole shit where niggas is like, oh, you know, talk about they came to the city and they won and yada, yada, yada. Nobody cares about them niggas, mo. Them niggas, first of all, most niggas that came to the city, uh, speaking on, 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 on Big White Boy, that nigga, he's not like that, bro. He's like, all of that shit is like not cool. Like, we entertaining niggas. That's what all this shade room shit is about. That's what all this hating shit is about. It's like we, we dwell off of that. Mm -hmm. If niggas really just got together and just built, we could all be talking about how we making money, how we feeding our kids, how we getting niggas scholarships and all of that. From my platform, I got colleges hitting me up and I'm posting it on my Instagram and niggas is getting scholarships from that. I never had an idea that I was going to do that. So fuck all this who claims that, that a nigga's good or if a nigga's a content creator or if a nigga's a... Who cares? It's about passing it on to the next person and, and somehow making this shit worth it. Right. I think I all get caught up in the, the, the um, ideology that we have to be validated by our peers. Facts. We're competing with each other in the city and niggas outside of the city not fucking with us. You know what I mean? Like, we should come together and really run shit, really, really go these places and really leave our impact and show why we still are the Mecca, why we still are one of the top dogs, why we still are that. If our top hitters don't want to go out, then it has to be who's next in line. Thanks. If they don't want to go out, it has to be who's next in line. It can't be, you know, um, our mid, low grade or whoever hoopers go out, we go out and then our uh, niggas ain't claiming us like, oh yeah, you know, that's not really us. But not niggas ain't outside. Y'all niggas ain't hey, doing it. Hey, hey, hey. Don't, don't, don't talk about what, what it could be or what it should be. Y'all niggas ain't doing it. Right. Hey, hey, man, for, for, for in other words, it's like...